Karis leave. Yay. Karis leave for me is going to be quite similar in a lot of ways to parental leave. Um, and, and this is going to be for those individuals that are caring for dependents um, on, a, on a long-term basis as well. So not just the short-term kind of caring, but on a long-term basis. All of those things need to be defined, by the way. So what is long-term um, and what is qualifies as a dependent and those sorts of things need to be, be kind of scoped out. But this is looking at giving people that are caring for individuals that are dependents over a long-term basis five days per year of carer's leave. That's leave to help and support, obviously, the person they're looking after. Um, and it's likely that this process is going to be probably unpaid. And that's why I'm saying it's very similar to me, in my mind, the way I think about it, not always logical, um, is going to be quite similar to like parental leave, uh, which is also equally unpaid. So it's one of those things, again, it's coming more up more and more a lot more of us are in our personal lives caring for other individuals as we get older the older we get we're living for longer um and obviously the more more issues and health concerns relatives do come up with or potentially you have members in your team that are caring for for elderly relatives but also maybe caring for um you know other dependents children and and so on and so forth so rambling there for a minute jesus so um in that sense of things uh, this is going to be another one of those that, that could come in that, to be honest with you, is it going to make a, a lightning break, make or break difference to your business right now? No, probably not. But it's something to be aware of. Um, and that's the, the important thing here, to, to be honest with you.